Hey everyone, welcome back. So we have the year seven season 3.3 preseason designer notes and this is some changes coming to the test server, which will then almost likely come to the live build. These are absolutely insane. I just got a glimpse at them. So we're gonna jump straight into it and we're gonna talk about it. Now quickly skimming over the wind delta graph. As you can see, Finca has fallen massively. That's a great sign in my opinion. And uh, now Zofia is probably the highest attacker in the game. And looking at defense, Alibi is all the way at the top as well. Expect an Alibi nerf coming very soon. I think they should remove 1.5 from her gun and honestly I'd say that's the only issue with her I think other than that just remove 1.5 now getting to these balancing changes these are insane so firstly Dokabe now affects defenders who are on cams when they're dead probably not even noticed this before but now she'll knock off defenders who are camming whilst they are dead but that's not the major one here the major ones are these next ones Rook's armor vest now grants withstand now we've known this for a little while now but this is now going to be coming to the game anyone who takes Rook's armor whether you're on defense or attack will have the withstand ability meaning that you can revive yourself this is making Rook one of the most meta operators now, and I can guarantee so many people are going to play Rook. But this I did not see coming. They are making Doc's heals go from 40 HP to 200 per heal. And now he's also getting the Bailiff as a third secondary? What? Doc is going to heal you to 200 HP. Is this a, is this a typo? Like, oh... <laughs> 200 HP per heal on Doc. I've been saying that Thunderbird is overpowered and better than Doc. That doesn't mean we need to buff Doc. That means we need to nerf Thunderbird. 200 HP. Ubisoft, what? What? And he's also getting the Bailiff as well. Is the secondary which Alibi and Maestro have. This is absolutely insane. 200 HP buff to Doc. What the hell? He's going to heal people to 200 HP. What? And he still has the same amount of stims. They said that they've not said that he's lost any stims. This is inc what? Castle's gotten another pistol. I believe this was the pistol he lost when he got his super shorty. So I think they're actually just giving this back. They're increasing Kali's damage to 135 from 127. I think this is quite good. I think Kali's a bit inconsistent. Sometimes you can shoot someone and they won't die. And that's you basically lost a gunfight, even though you already hit your shot. So I'm happy to see a buff to Kali sniper any day. Uh, Cade and Goyo have just got increased ammo on the TCSG. I didn't really think this was necessary, I didn't really think this was an issue, but um, yeah, whatever, I guess we'll take it. I didn't really think that was an issue before. Overhealing has been nerfed, you can now overheal to 20 HP, down from 40. And this is where I'm a bit confused as to why then Doc can heal for 200 HP. When the max that you can go now to is what, like 120 or something like that. But I'm happy to see a nerf to overhealing. I just, I think it should be completely removed. I don't think overhealing should be in this game. But a nerf at the moment, it, I'll take it, you know. The last bit I'm not really sure about. It says increased recoil bonus to plus 20% on attachments. I think that means that they're decreasing recoil across the board or they're decreasing it, or I don't really know what this means. <laughs> Can anyone else help interpret this for me? Because I don't understand what increased recoil bonus means to 20%. Are they increasing or decreasing recoils? Anyone out there more knowledgeable here can explain what that is. So I'm not going to really give a definitive answer on what it says. I think it means they're decreasing recoil. I can't imagine them adding any more recoil to the game. But uh, yeah, I'm not 100% sure on that. But uh, yeah, guys, be sure to let me know your thoughts on these uh, changes. I think they're absolutely crazy. Have a great day, guys. I'll catch you all later. Peace. Thank you.